what's up guys welcome to subnautica very excited to be hopping into this today but i actually don't really have a great understanding of what this game is other than the fact that it is an underwater-esque survival-esque story that can be pretty spooky considering you're underwater with all these other creatures uh a lot of stuff that goes into this game uh but currently when this video comes out I don't know when it ends, but this video, this game was up for free on the Epic Launcher, which is where I got it. I've heard some uh, pretty good things about it, so I figured we'd jump in. I'm going in pretty much completely blind, other than I watched the trailer. So, uh, let's go ahead and hit play. We'll go ahead and start a new game right here. What do we got? We have a couple of different ways we can play. Survival. Crash land on a dangerous alien planet. Scavenge resources and manage hunger and thirst to survive. Life survival, but without hunger and thirst. One life only. Uh, no oxygen alerts build anything with no constraints oxygen food fresh story and death disabled i think we'll go with survival i think i think <clears throat> gotta worry about food and the water also the the soundtrack so far for this game seems pretty epic uh also i put myself on this side of the screen i may have to move myself uh i jumped into one person's uh like let's play video of it jumped to like 15 minutes into it paused it just to see what the hud looked like so because over on, on that side over there, there's like some, all your, your HUD stuff over there where it says loading. So hopefully this is a good place for me to go. Uh, but yeah, we'll go ahead and load on in here and uh, see what happens. <clears throat> oh, toughest choice of the game. What button should we go with? There are just, there are just so many buttons to go with. Let's just... Oh, Attention. Unknown World Entertainment exists. Present, not exist. I mean, I'm sure it exists as well. Most of it is stuff. Oh, oh, what's happening? Launch in three, two, one. Oh, I expected us to get launched out of that. Oh, no, we're getting launched out of that. Did we close the top? I feel like we should definitely close. Or is that a. Is that, okay, that looked like a glass top. I was like, it's all in the water. Uh, okay, fire extinguisher. That looks like. Okay, metal. Please don't kill me, metal. This. No. Oh, okay. Yep. That's how the game ends. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I. Oh, oh, never mind. We're alive. All right then. Oh, there's a fire. Uh, let me out. All right. Uh, cool. All right. So I'm assuming we need that fire extinguisher. Is, is that not the game? Uh, yes, it is. All right. Let's pick up the fire extinguisher. Uh, press eight. Alright, we right click. Excellent. Alright, still got some more fire. Fire be gone. Oh, cool. It also, like, cleaned the walls, too. Awesome. Alright. I assume this is our inventory type thing. Booting in emergency mode. Alderia. Alderia. Alright, loading. You're almost there. You have suffered minor head oh. trauma. This is considered an optimal That's good. outcome. This oh, PDA, PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien okay. world. <clears throat> Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Alright, plus tap to open close PDA. Cool. Uh let's see over here our voice log. You okay that's I just wanted to hear it again. Okay, I guess I can. Uh oh. I guess it's not a play button. Alright, so that's our data bank. Uh, oh, no, I was just kidding. This is I didn't really want to hear it. <clears throat> Press F11 to take a screenshot. You have suffered minor head trauma. This is uh, alright, we got our life pod. Oh, okay, so like, uh, we can make like little map points? Oh, that's cool. Uh, basic materials and stuff that I have right now. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival I guess that's stuff that's on me. Oh, no, 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 that's, oh, these are blueprints, stuff that I, I can't make. All I have on me right now is a fire extinguisher. Uh, something like titanium ingot, or ingot, I need 10 titanium, and I need metal cells. All right, so, uh, cool. All right, warning, circuitry test failed. Secondary systems offline, radio offline, distress signal broadcast failed. Flotation devices deployed, good. And the whole integrity is just okay. All right, so we got one of, uh, it looks like we have all three of our power cells online, right? Yeah, uh, power 25, 25. Am I going to have to worry about power? Oh, my gosh. All right, damage secondary. Use a uh, repair tool. Do I have a repair tool? I don't know. Uh, do I know how to make one? 
equipment. Uh, pyre... Scan it, repair tool. Alright, so I need silicon, rubber, cave sulfur, and titanium for that. But wouldn't I need... I need a metal salvage for that. Is that something I have on board? Maybe I should just look around what we have here first. Uh, use a fabricator. Sustenance. Water. Unknown ingredients. Okay. Ploy over personal resources. So this looks like this is like our, our uh, crafting table. That's what that looks like there. Cool. Uh, what do we have over here? Uh, damaged radio. Need to use our repair tool for that. Alright. Let's just climb the ladder then. Is that a, is that a what is the, what the crap are you? Oh, so there's our spaceship. Is there anything we can salvage in that maybe? The Aurora suffered orbital pulse okay. failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs. Oh, so I am human. Okay. I got my flip. I got my flips on. Those are. All right. I guess we'll swim over to the ship. Oh. Okay. All right. So what's my measure for breathing? Okay, so the uh, the big the oxygen right there. So basically, I can stay about forty-five seconds underwater, I guess. <coughs> okay, so what's this down here? This just oops, uh metal salvage. When I do this, am I still breathing? Is that... Oh, okay, yeah, that still runs down one RPDA. <coughs> Perfect. Let's hop up here. Full RPDA. I don't want to go underwater. I really want to stay above water. While I look at my PDA. I really just want to stay above water. I really just want to stay above water. Perfect. Thank you, guys. Uh, survival knife? I feel like that would be good to get. Um, waterproof locker. Titanium. Oh, so wait, we can build a base? We can build our base larger? Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's real cool. What we got over here? Oh, yeah, that was that one from earlier. Uh, metal salvage. Yeah, we can drop it out if we need to. I don't know if we can actually do anything with that. Uh... I don't really know what we need to do first. Actually, I'm just going to swim over to the ship. See what we can figure out over there. Oh, it's so spooky under here, guys. I'm going to get killed by a shark or something. Oh, also my food's going down. I forgot about that. Food and water. I really need to get focused on that. I like that as soon as you come up over water, like, the mask goes off. Is it like, a, like an Iron Man type thing where it just kind of goes on automatically? <clears throat> the world may never know. Life oh. on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. Yeah, I want. Is there like any actual land in this game? Like, did we land in the middle of an ocean? Oh, radiation detected. Oh, are you, are you telling me I shouldn't go in there? Is that like a late game thing? Okay. Seems like it's a late game thing. All right. Let's see if we go over right here. Pop up, yeah, okay. Alright, so that's the way of telling us to get away from it. Uh, is there anything below it that we can use? There's some more metal scraps down here. We can, some of that. we can probably use that for something. We probably should really just check out the area below us. Below our, oh, what's that over there? What is that? What is that? What is that? That looks like maybe actually something used. Supply crate! What we got in here? some health. I mean, still, health's pretty good. Okay, so we should be on the lookout for some of those some supply crates. Also, is there a... I'm assuming, like, in a later game we can make... Yeah, we can make some uh, actual tanks instead of, basically, it just seems like we're holding our breaths. What is that? Is that something cool? Oh, what are you? Oh, a creature. Oh, I probably shouldn't have picked that up. Probably shouldn't have picked up this creature's egg. Can I pick up this metal, metal salvage? Probably shouldn't have picked up some random creature's egg. <clears throat> Unless I can go fry it and get some dinner. I don't like this creep vine. 
Focus yes, I, I am going towards the surface. I promise that I am. Oh, it's telling me I need to eat something. Uh, can I eat this random creature egg? No, I cannot. Uh, advanced theories. Uh, that is a substantial number, if not all, the local egg laying. Buried beneath are wedged cracks, different species. Eggs are a form of natural stasis. Scans suggest the spire's <clears throat> extensive However, diversity and connects to a number of small. Oh, okay, so I can actually I can hatch eggs. What was that one about? I completely didn't hear that. Short range scans suggest this biome supports extensive biodiversity and connects to a number of small. Oh, okay, so there's like some underwater caves I can explore. Is the sun going down? No, no, no. No, 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 no. I don't want to be here when the sun goes down. Awesome. I need food. Real bad. Don't know where I'm going to get food. I'm sure it's like right next to my place, like the first time it shows you how to do food. And I just wasn't there for it. Like that over there, there's something floating next to our pod. I should probably go check that out. Probably should not have spent the entire day swimming over there. I'm just so afraid there's just a shark that's going to get me, guys. Blows a molt in a Sinosis life cycle. Oh, in interesting. Yeah, I'll drop you in here if you're like a. Ow! <laughs> I don't know why that hurt, but it did. Oh, we need to get a flashlight. That would really be helpful. This is like Minecraft where creatures come out at night. I know I got hit because I ran into the floater. I know that's what hurt me, but are like, there are other things that are going to hurt me. Break limestone. Okay, I'll come break the limestone. I assume this is trying to tutorial me. Alright, I broke limestone. Now what do you want me to do? Did you teach me anything? No. Alright, I'm gonna get back onto the ship. Or the life pod, rather. Maybe I will. Can I? Okay. I was like, can I actually get back onto it? I'm gonna go ahead and board it. <coughs> okay, so. Uh, oh, we. Oh, we did get titanium. From the limestone? Okay, so titanium comes from limestone. Uh, so that's cool. We have that. Or does our metal salvage break into titanium? Where's my uh, fabricator? Yeah, it sure does. Make me some titanium. Dude, make me all that titanium right now. Guys, we're doing stuff. We are legitimately making stuff happen all right so now that i have that let's exit out of that go back into our pda uh sweet so we don't have a decent amount of titanium so what is form of first and foremost that we need the repair tool no because we need cave sulfur and silicon rubber the scanner we need a battery uh flashlight we need battery and glass all right <coughs> hmm hmm as, oh, let's yeah, let's get that actually. Let's get ourselves a, an actual tank so we can last underwater a little bit longer. Uh, a battery. We need copper ore. Urgh. So yeah, there is actually oh bleach, salt deposit, and coral tips. Quartz to make glass. What is what is some stuff we actually need here? Uh. Blue crits and uh, yeah, I feel like the repair tool could also be super useful. Flashlight, one hundred percent, and a survival knife. Ooh, there's a vehicle. Ah, oh, there's so much cool stuff we can build. Calorie intake recommended. Oh, we need food. My tummy's all rumbly. How do I get food? Uh. It's just water. I don't know how we get food. Uh, let's go ahead and make a tank, though. Yeah. New blueprint acquired. Cool. All right. Uh, so do we just put that on? Okay. No, it's already on. It's cool. Do we have to make flippers? I I don't know. I need food. Uh, it's so dark. I don't know how we get food. Surely there's got to be some easy food nearby, though. Alright, well, 
get us some of that so that way we can actually get more stuff. Is there some supply stuff over here? No, you aren't anything. Also, this makes it stay underwater much longer, which is nice. I don't know if it's like a one-time use or what. But we'll make the most of it. If we get a knife, can we stabby stab some fish? I don't know. Giant coral tubes, we can probably break some coral off of that with, with a certain tool. I don't know. It's just so dark. So dark. I don't know what to eat. That stuff is glowy. Let's go check that stuff out. Let me get some air real fast. Ooh, okay. Uh, acid mushrooms. Like I just eat those. Like I just... Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during Planet Fall. Okay. I just, I want food to eat. Is it daytime already? It is daytime already. I'm okay with daytime. I like daytime. Daytime is nice and not as scary. I just need food. Oh my gosh. How do I get food? I think I'm real stupid. Like, I, I didn't... I didn't read too much other than on a getting started page it says your life pod has uh, some food inside of it, some nutrients bar. Evidently we didn't search everything in here. Uh, that's a medical kit fabricator. Oh, maybe, you know, the storage container. Yeah, you know, it has two flares, uh, disposable light source useful for distracting certain threaditors as well as a nutrient block. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and pull that out of here. Uh, I guess right-clicking also sends it over. Uh, and some water as well, since we're getting pretty close to needing that. Uh, and let's go ahead and consume that up. Vital signs. And uh, drink up some water as well. Cool. All right, we got we got water going. Pick up pep pe peeper. Is that a fish? New creature How did that get in here? Why is that in here? I don't know, that doesn't make any sense. I'll throw you in there for whatever reason. Uh, as well as that creature X. We really don't need that. Met metal salvage, let's go ahead and get some more uh, titanium going. Oh, what? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We can just cook it straight from there? Oh, okay. So we got, okay, so we have food kind of understandable. We have to kill it though. Uh, so we do need to get that survival knife going. Uh, so let's, well, let's focus on, uh, that today. Uh, blueprints. We also can go for that now, but, uh, it'll be my next. Fins. Uh, survival knife. Survival knife. We need silicone rubber, which we can make, right? No, we need creep vine seed cluster. How do we do that? I'm sure we can just swim up to it and grab it off of somewhere. <clears throat> Alright, what else are we working on? A flashlight glass and a battery glass comes from uh quartz uh battery comes from two acid mushrooms and copper ore we picked up acid mushrooms before so we know where those are we just need to find copper ore uh and then a repair tool cave sulfur silicon rubber we'll get there eventually all right let's go try and get some uh creep vine stuff so that way we can actually, you know, focus on our food. I know I saw some over next to the ship. So let's dive over there and uh, swim over towards that fun stuff. Are you about to get eaten? Oh, oh, oh eye table! Ah! Get stuck in the table coral. Also, let's save. Oh, this looks like what we need right here. <clears throat> Looks like it's just hanging out in the bottom of it. Yeah, that's the creep vine. Uh, oh, 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 we can pick it up. Alright, cool. So we got a decent amount of it there. Uh, which gives us the survival knife because it's the silicon rubber. Right? Just one piece needs it. Uh, let's see if we can get a couple more, though. We'll probably need a lot of that. Oh, inventory full. Cool. Let's go ahead and head back to, to the uh, life pod then. All right, so we'll go into basic materials, uh, get some uh, creep vine seed clusters going. Got ourselves some uh, rubber. Get that up again. 
uh, personal equipment. Uh, no, it'll be tools. Get ourselves a survival knife. Nice. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following oh. the massacre. On that makes sense, I guess. The knife remains the only exception. Oh, okay, that's cool, I guess. Uh, we also need just cave sulfur for the repair tool. Uh, so I think that's something we should really focus on. Uh, water for a small storage solution that maintains position of the water. Oh, okay, that, that's cool. So if we ever fill out this one over here, we could build that pretty cheaply. Uh, other equipment. Fins. We already, we, we have fins on, right? I don't think, it's only, it's only two rubber. Let's go ahead and build it. Maybe we don't. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate <coughs> equipment using locally available materials. Yeah, that's cool. For your safety, this setting cannot be over. Okay, no, we didn't have any uh, fins on, so now we do. Cool. These grape vi creep vine seed clusters take up a lot of room. Uh, so let's go ahead and actually just spin those all into uh, rubber. I don't think I need them for anything else. At least something I'm aware of. Oh, lubricant, naturally derived. Huh. We'll probably need that for something later on. But for now, we'll, we'll turn all of these into rubber because we'll definitely need the rubber. All right. And we'll go ahead and. Oh, we can exit out the bottom? Oh, we'll look at that in just a sec. We'll go ahead and. Uh, I wish this stuff could stack. Go ahead and throw all this stuff into our storage. We're going to fill up it up real fast. Yeah. Uh, let's take back four of these. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Uh, fabricator, can you give us a waterproof locker? Thank you. Uh, take back all my titanium. We'll put our titanium in this waterproof locker. And we'll leave our silicone in here. Right? Seems reasonable. I don't think I put it all in there. Okay, I can just top right. That's so scary to see that thing through. All right, uh, three. Can we just leave it underwater right here? Okay, calm down, Walker. Calm down, Mr. Walker. Do you not like being underwater? I'll just run into it. This might be a terrible idea. This might, oh, this holds like not that much. Surely we can build bigger ones later. All right, I'm just gonna leave you there. You have fun. Uh, we do have a knife now. Oh, we right quick. Cool. We should also be swimming faster now. Uh, oh, we're looking for cave stuff. Okay. Oh yeah, she did tell us about the caves earlier. Yeah. So let's look for. Oh, that's this cargo. Oh, okay. I just—I thought it'd be funny if I could like cut it off, but it actually uh, gives me stuff for that. So low. Surely there, there's something we can get later that will make us like go to the top a lot faster, right? Oh, that takes up weight. Oh, we can. Cons oh, that's food. Sure, I'll eat that. And I'm not really seeing any. Caves per se. Ooh, actually, now that I said that, I think I found it. Local scans show a nearby yep. cave entrance, depth 90 meters, leading to an unknown environmental biome. I'm just here for the cave sulfur. Right, this gets me silver, right? From what I got from that earlier one. Oh no, that got lead. Okay, so those can be a bunch of stuff. All right, before we go down in there, let's swim up real fast. This is gonna suck. I think actually, I think actually, what we're gonna do, we're gonna call it right here. And next time, we're gonna go try and figure out how to explore this cave. I'm gonna do a little bit of research, not a ton, just a little bit of research so that way I don't kill myself. Because I'm, I'm wondering if I make another oxygen tank like that we have right here, 
If I make another one of these and keep it in here, can I equip it when I'm down there and get more air? I don't know. But that's stuff we're going to figure out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys think you'd like this, let me know in the comments down below. Because uh, I just want something more. I love Town of Salem, but I just want something more on the channel that I think people would be interested in. So if this is one of those things that you'd be interested in, let me know. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.